a new presidential election cycle is getting angry. And Bernie Sanders finds himself in an unusual position on the sidelines. Bringing millions of progressive supporters behind their candidacy in 2016 and 2020. The independent senator from Vermont will not run for the White House in 2024. Instead, he now talks about his former rival Joe Biden and the grave situation. Another threat from Trump's term to democracy. Sanders expresses Biden's praise as president and insists that there are many things he will be proud of from his first period. However, no one sees Sanders as a supporter of the status quo. The Democratic Socialist has strong ideas about what the incumbent government can do to turn the contention with Trump into a great victory, or must do in Sanders' words. Sanders emphasizes that Biden should speak to American people at same level about seriousness of crises we face and expresses real obstacles to change an extremist GOP, uncontrolled billionaire power, and sends institutional Democrats such as Joe Manchin and Kirsten Sinema accuse them of preventing laws that change the lives of working-class families in this country. Rolling Stone is not only about very high risks the 2024 competition with Sanders, but also his support for strike of Hollywood writers. He also spoke about his empty dream working 32 hours a week and even Elon Musk's meteoric greed. The following transcript is arranged for length and clarity. Explain the risks of the 2024 election and why you support it instead of challenging Biden for candidacy. The American people, like Trump, were twice dismissed, accused of four times. He will make deep choices about whether they want bring someone back power. A pathological liar and trying weaken American democracy and direct us the right. Authoritarianism. Do we want such a person to be president of the United States? Editor's choice but what worries me is that if you look at the polls right now, you see a more or less equal situation Trump and Biden are facing. If you were to advise someone who has lost faith in the two-party political process a voter who is considering supporting a third-party candidate, such as Cornell West what would you say to join Biden? 24. So I know something about this topic. I will not argue with Cornell, a close friend, about his analysis of what is happening in America. We have a country where our political system degenerates due to Citizens United and billionaires buying elections. On other hand if Trump becomes president again, we are in the possibility that U.S. will lose its democratic foundations. And this risk is so great that people will have to say look, we have to beat Trump and support Biden. But they can also clearly tell Biden that he should stand much stronger next to the working class. It is not good enough for him to focus on his achievements. We will have to undertake corporate greed and we need young people, working class people and activists to play a role in it. How do buy?